to Mary. Hail Mary, beloved daughter of the Eternal Father. Hail Mary, admirable mother of the Son. Hail Mary, faithful spouse of the Holy Ghost. Hail Mary, my dear mother, my loving mistress, my powerful sovereign. Hail my joy, my glory, my heart, and my soul. Thou art all mine by mercy, and I am all thine by justice, but I am not yet sufficiently thine. I now give myself wholly to thee, without keeping anything back from myself or others. If thou still seest in me anything which does not belong to thee, I beseech thee to take it and to make thyself the absolute mistress of all that is mine. Destroy in me all that may be displeasing to God. Root it up and bring it to naught. Place and cultivate in me everything that is pleasing to thee. May the light of thy faith dispel the darkness of my mind. May thy profound humility take the place of my pride. May thy sublime contemplation check the distractions of my wandering imagination. May thy continuous sight of God fill my memory with his presence. May the burning love of thy heart inflame the lukewarmness of mine. May thy virtues take the place of my sins. May thy merits be my only adornment in the sight of God and make up for all that is wanting in me. Finally, dearly beloved mother, grant, if it be possible, that I may have no other spirit but thine to know Jesus and his divine will, that I may have no other soul but thine to praise and glorify the Lord, that I may have no other heart but thine to love God with a love as pure and ardent as thine. I do not ask thee for visions, revelations, sensible devotion, or spiritual pleasures. It is thy privilege to see God clearly. It is thy privilege to enjoy heavenly bliss. It is thy privilege to triumph gloriously in heaven at the right hand of thy Son and to hold absolute sway over angels, men, and demons. It is thy privilege to dispose of all of the gifts of God just as thou willest. Such is, O heavenly Mary, the best part which the Lord has given thee and which shall never be taken away from thee. And this thought fills my heart with joy. As for my part here below, I wish for no other than that which was thine, to believe sincerely without spiritual pleasures, to suffer joyfully without human consolation, to die continually to myself without respite, and to work zealously and unselfishly for thee until death as the humblest of thy servants. The only grace I beg thee to obtain from me is that every day and every moment of my life I may say amen. So be it to all that thou didst do while on earth, Amen, so be it to all that thou art now doing in heaven. Amen, so be it to all that thou art doing in my soul, so that thou alone meets fully to glorify Jesus in me for time and eternity. Amen.